I am David Bro, and this is the seventh installment, seventh and final installment of the Compassion Relays video log. Been doing this for I think the last eight days. I think it is a skipped a day, or something in, in there. Nonetheless, this is the final installation for this. I'm contemplating doing this. At the corner to continue the interest in it to see what other people have to say I'd asked a few people to share their concept of compassion or incidents incidences that incidents incidents that happen to them as far as self-compassion or compassion for others, or compassion to the planet. Um, no takers. I just ran into someone. I was walking home from yoga, and someone came up to me on the, on the as I was walking home and asked if I was a person that stands at the corner and asks about compassion. I said yes, and he asked me. Uh, why do I do what I do? And I do what I do because as a personal endeavor to bring awareness to compassion. And he found it hard to understand. And he, so I told him a little backstory here and he understood. And he was asking a few questions. It's nighttime here. It's what, 8.22 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. And I was walking home and I stopped for a little while to answer a few questions, continuous questions, to the best of my ability. And that was, I'd say that's an example of compassion to him. And at the same time, I realized I was on my way back home to eat. So I allowed him a few more questions. I explained to him that I needed to express some self-compassion to eat because I was hungry and allowed, allowed him to ask one more question and reminded him that oftentimes the answer is in the question and was on my way. Another thing that happened at the corner, it was clear today and I was able to return to the corner clear enough and I, I was very mindful today and I'm still mindful at the moment. And the man came up today who comes up every now and then and just needed maybe three or four minutes to feel a little energy of the corner and he did that and I asked many people today I think one person wrote I waved to many people I said hello to many people I think today I would say about 40 to 45 people were acknowledged by a smile or eye contact or a wave in the span of about three hours, at which point I came home and I ate some lunch, made some lunch and ate some lunch. <clears throat> in relation to the planet, I continued to compost and along the way to the corner this morning, I picked up a few trash. That was the main theme this week. There weren't any wrappers today. I mean, junk food wrappers. There are all just white pieces, mostly white pieces of paper, and that—that that was the duty to the planet today: composting and picking up trash. I will reflect on the week. The week, since it was raining a lot and I was inside, I needed to find ways of expressing compassion to others in a new way. I thought that the online 
offering went really well. Uh, I think that I will continue doing what I do because I know that it's needed to bring awareness to compassion and they're often <coughs> those on a daily basis that express their gratitude for what I do and I continue to let that gratitude flow to fuel the energy within me to continue doing what I do until I can no longer do it because of some because of something that prevents me from doing it physically <laughs> that's the thing I can only think of that would prevent me from doing what I do physically being unable to do it um, again I'm grateful to Lisa Walker for starting these compassion relays I will pass them on and again I will bring the laptop to the corner and talk to people see if they would like to express themselves and video video logs and that way I will add to the channel and come home and edit Again, I am grateful and I bid you a good night.